I'm Julie Murphy. This is my sixth grade advanced life science class at Short Pump Middle School. And we are going to be talking about the nitrogen cycle. So you guys all have your notes out, correct? Yes. OK. So can somebody tell me from last class what nitrogen is used for? Why is it important to us? Yeah. It's needed to make chlorophyll in photosynthesis. OK. So we use it, plants use it for photosynthesis. What else? Why is it important to animals? Well, and plants. But what is it in our cells that needs nitrogen? DNA. Remember the nucleotide bases we talked about a unit or two ago? They require nitrogen. So where do we get our nitrogen? Where is nitrogen? Where do we find most of it? Like 78% of it. The atmosphere? Our atmosphere has lots of nitrogen. Can we use it in that form? No. OK, so that brings us to today. We cannot, there's lots of nitrogen around us. But it's kind of like being in the ocean when you're really thirsty. Can you drink ocean water? No. Is it water? Yes. What happens if you drink it? Oh, can somebody raise their hand because I can't hear you. Yeah. It's salt water. Can your body use salt water? No. no. So we are swimming in a big old ocean of nitrogen, and we need nitrogen, but our body can't use it in the way it is around us. So we need to get it in a different form. And lots of really cool things, mainly bacteria, does that for us. You are going to play a game today. In this game, you are going to be an atom of nitrogen. And you are going to be traveling through the nitrogen cycle. You may go one place. You may go five places. You may get stuck somewhere. You may actually make an entire cycle. Everybody's journey, do you think it'll be the same or different? Can somebody raise your hand and tell me why you don't think it's going to be the same as everyone else's? Because I heard a lot of people say it was going to be different. Why do you think it's going to be different? Oh, <laughs> yeah. What do you mean by other places? That's an excellent answer. So some people might go to the atmosphere, but somebody else might go to groundwater instead. When you get this, please put your name on it. Oops, sorry guys, I missed you. Here's what this is. This is your passport for the nitrogen cycle. Like a passport, you are going to get stamps for all the places that you have been. It's going to kind of keep track of where you went during the nitrogen cycle. So you are going to choose. There are 11 stations around this room. You're going to choose one to start at. I have tried to put the stations where they make sense. So for example, the atmosphere is by the window because outside. Um, our dead plants and animals are by our decaying pumpkin that is trying to come back to life. Live plants are actually by the live plants, but be gentle over there because they're live plants and we don't want your lab to not make them live and have to move them over to the dead plants and animals. That would make us sad. Animal waste is by our garbage. Um, ocean is by our little fish tank over here. The surface water, groundwater, and rainwater are all by the sinks. The soil is in the back of the room, and so are live animals. They all have a bright pink purple sheet, which will help you be able to find them. You are going to choose one. Doesn't matter which one you go to. Let's say we're going to start over here with our rotting pumpkin at dead plants and animals. At each station, you are going to find a dice, and you are going to find a bunch of stickers. When you get to your first station, you are going to write it where it says start location. Okay? You're going to take the dice. You're going to roll the dice. I got a six. So when you look at the sheet, for number six, it says, there was a forest fire. The wood you are within is burnt, and you have been released into the atmosphere. Atmosphere is a big, bold letter, words. So you're going to read that big, bold word, and that is the next place you're going to go. So from my dead plant and animal, I would find the atmosphere. 
I would go to atmosphere, I'd roll the dice, it would tell me where to go. Does that part make sense? Yeah. Okay. Before you move on your passport, you need to write down what happened. So it says, so you're putting your start location, I put in dead plants and animals. And then underneath, it says trip number one, how I traveled. I was burned in a forest fire. So I would write, I was burned in a forest fire. And then there's a place for a stamp. So I would take a sticker from that spot, I would put it here, and then I would move to my next station. So when you are done, you are gonna have eight stickers from eight different places. Does anyone have questions on what you're doing? Or need clarification? Okay. There should, because there's 11 spots, there should not be more than three people starting at one station. You are working individually, even though you're gonna be around lots of people, because your path, like you said a few minutes ago, is going to be different, or may be different, from everybody else's path. You are your own atom of nitrogen. You're gonna go wherever the dice tells you to go. So I'm going to have you push your chairs in in a second and choose a station to start, and then you are going to move throughout the room. If you get done before everyone else gets done, there are questions on the back about what your travel looked like. So if you get finished and you're waiting for other people to finish, you can go back to your seat and work on telling me about your trip, okay? Thumbs up if you know what I'm talking about. You're good. You got it. Excellent. So they just know where we are by our Did you find the dice? It's over there. Okay. Make sure you write where you're starting. Where's your Right where you're starting. Next, what do I want? Where's the die? Where's the die? Where's the die? Oh, oh right. Four. Where did you go? Ooh. Okay, so yes, let's go back over to live plants. You're just writing live plants. You need to roll the dice. I thought you were just like turning. Nope. Roll the dice and figure out where you're going. Uh, yeah, she said that this, this sticker doesn't work. So, how I travel, I got eaten by an animal. And now you're going to go to live animals. And when you're at live animals, you get your stamp to live animals. Yes. Like everything that we need to in Nope, you're just putting where you started. So you started it, you can just put live animals right there. Then you're going to, whatever you rolled, um, you can, so this is what happened. So you're gonna put, um, my I died, my animal died. You're gonna put your sticker for the station there and you're gonna go to wherever it told you to go. Do you have to write the animals died in that box? Nope, you just put live animals in that first box. Yeah. So, so, where, so I, I traveled into the groundwater. Okay. So where did you take So now you need to go find groundwater. Um, where is it's over by one of the sinks. It's with, yep, it's right there. So the stamp, do I just put it here? No, put it right here. In the little stamp box. Oh, so I put it right the stamp right there. So this needs to be your start location. So wherever, what station did you start at? Um, start at soil. Okay, so you're going to write soil right there. You got dissolved, and you're in groundwater, and you can put your sticker right there, and then you're going to go to groundwater. Okay. Samantha, where are you headed? I'm going to single-handedly take Okay, we'll take your stuff with you. Your brain is not braining. It's not. I understand that. So how did you get over here? Uh, I went to an animal um. and they pooped me. <laughs> so, wait. And now where are you going? Um, let's see. Uh, or again. Oh, well, wait, that I'm makes going sense. To my original spot. You're already cycling. I'm not even kidding. I just went down the groundwater again. 
Really? Yeah. That's amazing. You're just going to be in the water forever. I hope you like water. You know how to swim, right? Yeah. See, you're good. <laughs> we good? That one is around the corner. Back to fertilizer. Can you guys raise your hand if you've already gone to a station you have been to before? No, I haven't been to one yet. Just two of you? Three of you? Four of you. Okay. So does it make sense you're stuck in a cycle? <laughs> I'm sorry. That's just what happens to you when you're nitrogen. I walked into the Okay, I finally broke the cycle. Okay. Now where are you going? Oh shit. Oh, more water. <laughs> so did you really break the cycle? Not really. Girls, you doing okay? It's this is possible that I go straight back. Yeah. 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 What do you mean? Oh my God, like, like, some people are they started here. <laughs> and then Make sure you're right where that is. To the next place. Here. That's okay. You're fine. You're in the cycle. It's all good. Can you go to the same place twice? You're probably going to go to the same place yeah, I just, twice. Where's I want to soil? No. No way. It's over there. there. That's no, fine. No way. No way. No way. Where, 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 now where are you going? going? Back to where you just were? <laughs> Wait, where's I had a one in six chance of rolling it again. <laughs> and you did it. Oh my god. You should play the lotto today. You know what? Yeah, probably. You're live animals. Go live animals. Watch me roll an odd number. Yeah, but you gotta keep going. You you yeah, yeah keep going. You're doing okay. Oh wait, I'm gonna see ocean. Whatever you write here, you put the sticker for that spot there. Oh I put it in the wrong direction. That's okay. I'm done. You're all done done? Where did you end up? Where'd you start? Fertilizer. <laughs> Are you on your last one? Yeah. Excellent. Yeah. You started here, so then you went one, two, three, four, six, seven, eight. Nine, because you started at that one. Okay. But, but are you going to count things that you repeated? So last class, I had you guys taught each other a little bit about the nitrogen cycle. Last class, you kind of tried to draw it, and some of you were like, I don't really get this. So we're going to try to draw it again. Live plants. Raise your hand if you started at live plants. No one? Oh, you started at live plants. Cool. Where did you go from live plants? I went to, um, to one of the green. I don't know what it's called. So. Well, what happened to you at live plants? The animal that I was with died. No, before that. What happened to you at live plants? I was eaten by You were eaten by an animal, so you probably went to live animals, is my guess? Yeah. Okay. So from live plants, you went to live animals. Live plants to live animals. Who else went to live animals? Izzy, where'd you go from live animals? Uh, you died as a an an live animal? Did anybody go someplace different from live animals? Yes, no, maybe. Joel. From live animals, you went to fertilizer? Okay. From dead plants and animals, where did you go? Yeah. From dead plants and animals, you went to surface water? Okay. Did anybody, as an atom of nitrogen, go someplace else from dead plants and animals? 
You went to soil? What about from surface water? Where did you go? You went to groundwater? Did anybody go someplace different from surface water other than groundwater? James, where did you go? From surface water, you went to the ocean? And groundwater. And groundwater? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Groundwater. Where did you go from groundwater? Oh, you have another surface water? Where did you go from surface water? Oh. We're starting to cycle. Yes. From groundwater into ocean. From groundwater, you went to ocean. Anybody go someplace different from groundwater? Yeah. Surface water. You went from groundwater back to surface water? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Story of my life. <laughs> okay. Anybody go any place different from groundwater? All right, what about ocean? Where did we go from ocean? Where did you go from ocean? Atmosphere. Ooh, atmosphere. Yeah. Did we go any place different other than the atmosphere from the ocean? Where did you go? Any others? Okay, what about from the atmosphere? Where did you go from the atmosphere? Simone, where did you go? I went to the rain. rain. You went to rain? Yeah. Any others? Yes. I went to, um, yeah, I went to soil. From atmosphere, you went to soil? Yeah. Whew. We're going to make this line way over here. Okay. Yes. From rain, I went back to the ocean. From rain, you went back to the ocean. Did anybody go someplace different from rain? Um, Where did you go? Lake or stream. Um, lake or stream. So was that surface water or ocean? I think surface water. Surface water. So from rain. You went way down here to surface water. Yes. I can't hear you say that again. From ocean, you went to groundwater. Okay. What about fertilizer? We didn't talk about that. Did anybody go someplace from fertilizer? Where did you go? You went to live plants? Where did you go? Where'd you go? Yeah. From fertilizer? Okay. Whew. This is kind of a mess, huh? Yeah. Do you see how nitrogen travels from one spot to another? Okay. Raise your hand if you went to more than one spot. Let me try that again. Raise your hand if you went to the same spot more than once. <laughs> so that is a lot of you. Why did that happen? It's a cycle. Right. Can we create more nitrogen? If something is in a cycle, no. Are we ever creating more of it? No. no. Are we getting rid of it? No. No. It's just changing its form. And look at all the forms it changed. Does this make a little more sense than the nitrogen cycle we drew last class? Yes. Okay. Thank you for watching. We hope you enjoyed the lesson and learned something about the nitrogen cycle. Go, Go Blue Miles!